So a lot of woodworkers today are showing using CA glue on their wood projects. Uh, they're using it primarily indoors. Um, I've done it. Uh, my channel's small, so hardly anybody watches that. But um, some of the big influencers are using it, and they're using it indoors. They're not wearing gloves. They're not wearing a respirator. Uh, and I'm going to cut to the SDS, and I'm going to explain a little bit about that, and then we'll come back. Okay, and SDS stands for Safety Data Sheet. And every company that puts out any type of chemical is legally obligated to supply anyone that's interested that information. It has to be under a very specific format, and they have to make it readily available. Usually now, this is done via the internet, so any substance or chemical that you're interested in seeing the SDS for, you can search it on the internet, and you should easily be able to find it. Uh, so this is the SDS, after all that, for Starbond Accelerator Spray. So in section two, you can see some pictograms at the bottom. These four indicate what you're dealing with, and you can tell just by these images that it's probably not so good for you. And here I have another section of the SDS I wanted to touch on. Wear protective gloves, protective clothing, eye protection, face protection. Do not breathe mist, vapor spray. Use only outdoors or in a well-ventilated area. Now this is their recommendation. They're saying only use it outdoors. That's the first thing. If you're not using it outdoors, use it well ventilated area. A lot of people are probably using it in a closed up shop and this stuff evaporates so incredibly quickly. You are breathing the vapors. It goes on later to say that you could get permanent brain and nervous system damage, liver damage, etc. This stuff is not good for you. So if you want to read it for yourself, I'll provide the link in the description. I'll also provide the SDS link for the Mitropel. All right, now that I went over that, um, the CA glue itself is not, well, it's not good for you. Uh, but there's only so much liquid in there, and that uh, organic vapor is going to show up in the air that you're breathing. But this stuff, obviously, um, I can't pronounce this brand, Mit Mitropel or Mitro Mitropel, I don't know. Uh, there's Starbond, which I've used, and then this is a new one, which I just got because, hey, it was a good price on Amazon, and it's a big can, so it should go a long ways. But in the future, I'm going to start using it more outdoors if possible, and if it's winter and it's 10 below zero, that's not really possible. Uh, I'll wear a respirator, I'll wear gloves, I'll try to ventilate afterwards. This stuff is terrible for you. Uh, this flashes off so fast and those vapors go into the air you're breathing. Um, so you really shouldn't use it indoors. And uh, just word of warning, uh, be careful with this stuff. You know, we, we talk about uh, VOCs in finishes like um, varnishes, uh, polyurethane, lacquer especially, they smell terrible. Uh, but we kind of leave this out and there's a lot of influencers that are using it. Not that I have anything against using it, it's a tremendous tool. Uh, it works very well for a lot of applications to stick stuff together, stick stuff together very quickly, uh, especially with the activator. So uh, just to sum up, be careful. Use this outdoors if possible. And um, if you can't, try to take precautions to protect your health. So, hey, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.